Join us on a tar hunting trip into the Mount Cook area. As soon as we landed and had camp set up, we were out with the binos. We were spotting tar straight away, which gave us high hopes for the next morning. We were up before the birds with a big day planned ahead of us. We climbed about 600 metres and we were right up amongst the tar. We had about 15 tar on this face opposite us and all scattered around the place. Watched them for about two hours. Um, couldn't see any decent sized bulls in the group, but uh, it was still pretty cool to watch them.
weather had started to clag in and it was windy as hell up there. So we decided it was time to head for camp. Been plotting around a camp all, all morning. Doing all sorts of shit. Been watching quite a few avalanches come down all day. Stunning day. And, um, it's probably the best day we've had so far, weather wise. Unfortunately, there didn't seem to be as many animals uh, around at the moment, but we're picking it because of the heat. Oh yeah. Oh, it's behind that knob. Oh, I saw that. Was that a leap of faith to the death? Uh, no, yeah. uh, he's just gone down. He's running down. Uh, no, yeah, he's he has it. Yep, he just, just tumbled over. Tumbled over. We sat in the riverbed one afternoon watching this Mobitar up high. Watched them for about three hours.
We saw another little mob just down a bit further, and they're on a mission to this other rock. Must be something pretty exciting there for them.
unfortunately we didn't have any time to make it up to these guys but it certainly made some good plans for our next trip After a great week in the mountains, it was unfortunately time to go home back to reality.